Hello, Hacienda La Puente. This is Ricardo, one of your tech tosas. And today we are going to talk about how to be able to see your Canvas courses by sections or by periods. This video applies to any teacher that cross listed their courses. Uh, so you might be a combo teacher that cross listed third and fourth grade, or maybe a high school teacher that teaches common prep, so Spanish one, period one, period three. So if you remember in the past, you used to be able to go into filter gradebook, view, and filter by sections. And that will allow you to see it by periods, basically, right? Well, our new filtering with the new Canvas update has changed things a little, okay? So what you're going to do is you're going to come into grades, okay? And now, right now you're going to see all of your students that you've cross-listed into that period, okay? So what you need to do is very simple. You have to create a new filter. So I'm going to click on filters, okay? So I don't have anything yet. Let me create a new filter, okay? And I want to set a condition for this filter, okay? I want to set it to do it by sections, okay? And I want to give it a name. So maybe I'm going to call this one sections, okay? And I'm going to save it. And now that it's saved, I can apply that condition, okay? And notice that when I apply it, I can select just my period four, and apply it and I'll be able to over here just see my period four. You can see that the apply condition is right there. If I want to switch it to my period two, which is 10 and 12 graders, I can switch it and the students are going to change, okay? And I'd be able to just enter the grades for those students. Now, remember, I'm not showing you the students' names because of uh, obviously uh, confidential reasons, but this is how you will create your filter, okay? Maybe I wanted to see period three. I will switch it and I'll be able to see them all right there and be able to grade just that period, okay? Something to remember is that I created that filter, so it's going to stay there. I still have the ability to create different filters. Maybe I'm creating another filter that you want to just add a condition that you just want to see a module, you know, modules. Maybe you want to see submissions or start date or end date. My point is that you can have more than one condition and apply which condition you want to see. So if it's just because you have cross-listed your classes and you want to be able to see your sections separate so you can grade, this is the condition that I will apply. If you have any questions, please let us know. Have a great day.